Hey guys, I suck at doing a room tour. I just filmed this and it is horrible. Don't comment and be like, you didn't explain anything. I don't really know what I'm supposed to explain. This is a room tour. Uh, <laughs> I think it's such a weird video, but it's been requested so many times. Like, okay, I'll do it, but I just felt so uncomfortable just like going through my room. And I like watching room tours sometimes, but I hate when people are just detailed but undescriptive. That's what I hate. They're like, and here are my perfumes. And then they like touch all their perfumes, but they don't say anything about them. Or they'll go on to like one rant of like a story of how they got one perfume and I didn't want to watch that. Kind of just give you a general description. In some parts I'm like, there's my coat rack, but then I say nothing else about it. Okay, <laughs> enjoy watching the video. I hope that it was bearable and I will see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye. <laughs> We got the classic outside door that everyone shows before their video and then they open it up and then they go something like here's my room um so you know here's my room it's just square it has a little light rectangle that's where my bathroom is down there and then my closet is behind the television right there and then my window so just picture a rectangle and that's where we are here I have my dresser I don't know if I should go through my drawers. Let's, all right, let's try it. They're all messy. Well, I used to have organized drawers and I just kind of gave up. I have bandos and bras, tank tops. This is honestly no help. I probably didn't even show you guys this stuff. Um, T-shirts, shorts, athletic clothes, and then T-shirts and T-shirts. They're all rolled. I don't know if there's anything that says like my school on it, so whatever. Up here, I have bathing suits. Most of them are swim team up top though. And then I have my, it's just, everything in here is pretty much irrelevant and I need to throw it out. It just has no purpose except for my survivor buff. Um, Tom's bags and a slip. But other than that, I'm pretty sure these belts don't even fit me anymore. Then next thing, I got some underwear. I have socks. I have pajamas and pajamas. I have this little rack which is usually where I put my clothes for tomorrow but right now I haven't done that yet and I just have things sitting like my Betsy Johnson bag and this t-shirt that I got at a ball or gala but I've yet to take these things off and then it has an easy button down there. Over here I have my coat rack so I'm trying to get you so you feel like you're actually in my room. So that's where I was standing when I first walked in and here's my dresser, lingerie chest, oh my television if you couldn't tell. And then here we have the coat rack. So here I have a bunch of purses. I don't have a single coat on it, but I have hats up top. And this should be kind of up there. Okay, so that seems good. Um, I really don't know what else to say. That's the purse I use every day. That's my pool bag. That's my sleepover bag. That's my carry-on bag for traveling. My satchel I've been using a lot lately that my friend got me in Spain. Anyway. So then you walk in here and this is my closet. So I have all clothes hung and then shoes are up top. And they look like that. Little pan. A hamper, a stool that's great for everything. More shoes below. I have some track stuff, leggings, blankets. Um, oh, belts. I have this cool little belt hanger that I got from Ikea. It's actually really handy because belts are so hard to keep organized and I think this does a fairly good job of it. I have yoga pants, shorts, je denim shorts, and then um, jeans. And over here I have sweatshirts and in the back I just have sweatpants. I feel so weird doing this. Okay, I have bags, um, tights, and scarves. Okay, so that's good. And then my rug here is also from Ikea. And then we... Um, get to my bed. There it is. In all its greatness. Voila. A pillow. That's usually what I sleep on, but then when my bed's all made, there's not enough room for it and the pillows look really awkward, so I just put the body pillow over here. We have my curtains that go out to a lovely view of my backyard. And then we arrive over at this little table that I think has the funkiest bottom ever. Like, how cool is that, anyway? Um... It's 512, guys. Then I have this little fish plate that my grandma got for us in Hawaii. Well, not us, just me. I don't really share this plate with anyone else. 
eye bracelets. And this is actually um, this little thing I got from Relay for Life, which is a cancer run. I don't know if you guys have that where you are, but um, we do. And I donated this in Casey Sparkly Barbie XO's mom. I um, donated this and bought it in her honor. So I have my candles. Um, I don't know why I picked up those to show you, but I have Bath and Body Works ones and Yankee Candle. Um, I have shells in the beach, which I don't know why I have those. This little owl thing, which I think is adorable. I have a Zodiac Smurf. <laughs> How? I don't know. My friend told me I saw these at the beach, and what a random thing to invent. Like, let's take all the Smurfs and then make them people Zodiac signs so they can purchase them. I have my perfumes over here, and then this little book that I got at a free trade center, or a free trade store. I have sunglasses. They usually go all the way to here, but I, since I've started driving, I have sunglasses in each car, and I've just lost a bunch. And I have my lamp. Below us, I have a basket filled with goodies and such. I have my glossy box and a Sigma brush roll and colored pencils and, you know, standard stuff. And so let me kind of back up and show you where we are again. We're right by my bed. There's a perfume I just showed you. I just want you to get a feel for where I am. Um, my mirror over there. My makeup is all up here. I usually have this with lipsticks, but I lost all of them. I don't know where they are. I have this little philosophy free bag and this is my box of everything like when I get back from a hotel I put all the travel stuff in here or hand sanitizer or sprays or lotions or nail polish remover or um, just really anything <laughs> lip gloss eye drops Vaseline all goes in here in this lovely little basket of clutter then over here I have duct tape and then stuff for back to Mac because it's you buy anything from Mac and finish it Keep the packaging because once you get six, you can turn it in for like something free. Then I have my little nail polish kit. I have um, some nail polish and files. And then this is a box or basket with all the samples I ever get. And then a backup mascara, two backup mascaras. Yeah. And also, you can't really tell because it's going to be light, but I have little lights that I put on for Christmas, but then I just never took them off because I thought they looked kind of funky. Then I have my bedside table, so if you were to be sitting on my bed, you'd be able to reach for some lotion, some chapstick, this little label that my friend made me. How cute is she? Um, a sunglasses holder, socks, because my feet get cold at night sometimes, but then they don't, so I have to take them off, and then I'll, anyway. Okay, so I have this lamp that has my favorite headband ever on it. I have books and magazines. Um, this little decoration thing. There's not anything really important in it. And a clock. I have my drawer full of electronic cords, which is a really, really horrible way to store it. You're not supposed to store things all in knots, but anyway. Um, then I have school supplies, notebooks. They're not actually school supplies. I have index cards and a label maker and a calculator, but um, the rest is just sticky notes because I use notebooks all the time. My phone charger. Best part of the room door. That was a joke. And, oh, I didn't even show you on top of my dresser. Sorry. I, um, have no organization to my jewelry. I just keep an array of accessories on top of my dresser. I just look down at it in the morning and I just grab stuff. It should be more organized. But I'm one of those people that's out of sight that I never think of it. So out of sight, out of mind. I'll forget that I have it. <laughs> and so if it's all out in front of me, then I change up my jewelry more often. We took the door off my bathroom, which... I'm starting to think it was a bad idea, but the problem was the door opened this way, so it always hit my towels. So we got my counter, which has Q-tips, my little Sigma brush facial brush. That was a horrible description. Tissues, soap, my little box of everything that's kind of blue and white themed. I have perfume, dry shampoo, eye cream, face mask, makeup remover, lotion, um, room spray slash... I think it's a clothing spray. Apple cider vinegar, because you can put that on your zits and it clears them right up. And soap. And then I have soap, this little primer sample that I'm using, my retainer, toothbrushes, toothpaste, my curling iron, and my hair dryer. And then here we have my medicine cabinet that has all things that a medicine cabinet should. Look how, like I have an absurd amount of hand sanitizers. That's because you can always get the 5 for 5 deal and I never use them. Not even kidding, these are probably from 09. So, over here, I have my other medicine cabinet that has tissues and 
um, contact solution for my friend, and all the little samples that you get at Clinique and Lancome if you buy anything, but also eye drops, eye cream, body wash, sprays and lotions and such. A clock. Over here you have my little sailor window. All of my lush soaps and things like that. I have a bunch of stuff in here actually. Um, yeah, I have a good amount of different things. They go all the way to the bottom. You can't really see all the layers. Then my shower curtain which is from Target. I'm pretty sure that's where the towels are too. And that's from Bed Bath & Beyond. If you really want me to go through my cabinets, I don't know why you would, but uh, I will. I have lotions and things in here. Seriously guys, most of this is expired. I need to throw them out. Um, headbands and then hair clips, hair bows, um, ponytail hold or, um, headbands, ponytail holders, clips, tweezers. And over in here, I have all the makeup that I wore back in middle school that's so old I literally I'm so sorry like you probably don't want to hear me continuously just saying that I have old makeup and old products hair clips perfume primer lotion um, things like that and then in here I have oh that drawer is a mess okay well that's all I have in there and then we walk back out and you get a little visit to my room. Thank you guys so much for visiting and I will see you guys later. I hope this was okay. Do you have any comments, questions, or concerns about, I don't know what you could possibly ask about, but you know what? Go for it and I will answer them. Okay, bye! <laughs>